Well, good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. And we rise now for the Japanese national anthem. we have suggests it's going to be a 4-5-1 formation Jim well it's a formation Peter that lends itself to good possession and control in midfield because you've got the numbers there a higher concentration backing that up with enough attacking dynamism is down to managers who want to get at teams it can be used in cautious terms too but certainly if you want to advance a little quicker and you have that attitude then you can be very positive about this too Off we go then. Yoshida. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Kessier. Saha. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And it's Sahar. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Nagatomo, he's got away. Time to deliver. Did really well to intervene and dispel the groin. It's a sucko! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of you. You may have been thinking about back page headlines there. Saha. Links it across. Oh, good interception. He's on his way! Osako! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong make him right. minutes till the break and it's a soccer can't get the better of his opposite number 
And the referee's awarded a free kick. to drawn blanks and have toiled at times but it's not been a bad game by any means any opinion you'd like to express on the first half it's been a pretty abject performance no efforts at goal i'm struggling to remember the last time we had that interesting half just missing goals so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break nil nil and we're already back on the way here Ivory Coast, pretty fortunate not to be trailing at half-time. Goes for goal, and he's done it! Well, that's what the top players do. The ability to seize the initiative at crucial times in the game. And now this second half has a completely different outlook. Pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? I just think that's a good example of how you take advantage of a lapse in concentration. He was on the prowl, hungry, looking for any scraps that came his way. And he certainly gobbled up the chance, took it really well. for a change in personnel. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worth the three. Sarko. And it's Saha. Well weighted. He's gone for it. Back of the net. And with that goal comes comfort. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. starting to look very comfortable well they're very much the better team at the moment Peter and and no doubt will be looking to to cause even more damage here and here's Osako and now the breakaway just brushed off the ball there he wasn't very far from making something happen by himself lovely to see Kessier, chance to break. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Hits one! It's in! Japan are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heavily. Got ourselves a game here. 
Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Shibasaki. And here's Osako. He's through, now is he in? Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Good strong hand by the keeper. Oh, smart save, he had plenty to do. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes, goalkeeping at its very best. Oh, great ball! Plays it out to the flank. Shibasaki. Shibasaki! Keeper barely had to move. Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. He spotted the run and played him through. Gets the face to and the shot. The whistle is gone and it is all over. Ivory Coast have held on. A knife edge game, a single goal margin, but they have won it. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? But this is a team that doesn't look as if it's daunted away from home. They were organised and determined, and they can surprise again if that standard is maintained. All well, that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.